good Monday morning, everybody. It's Russell here. Welcome to my daily vlog. So, <clears throat> excuse me. It's Monday. It's gloomy. It's not cold. It's odd. <laughs> it's very spring-like weather. But, unfortunately, it's not going to last. Yes, I see the car coming up behind me. Um, we're, just, we're on the up right now, and then it's just going to go in this downward spiral for the rest of the week, unfortunately. So, yeah, and by Thursday, I think we don't even get out of the 30s. Boo and hiss. But, hey, <clears throat> it was a good weekend. It was a chill weekend. We, we did a lot of errands this weekend. <laughs> Went to Walmart twice. It, it happens. I finally got a lunchbox. Oh my god. Like, I've been saying for freaking two weeks now, I'm gonna get a lunchbox. And I finally did it. So, no, overall, it was a good weekend. I'm looking forward to this evening. Um, because I wouldn't say we had bad service. We went, uh,. Not this past weekend, but the weekend before, we went to El Centro for brunch. And the service honestly was not bad. I've been to El Centro before for brunch, so in my opinion, the service wasn't bad. The only complaint that I had, it just seemed like the food was taking a really long time to come out. So the manager stopped by our table, gave us these cards for to come back and have a free drink. All right, cool. Didn't expect anything more. So, you know, I don't know if any of you ever get these, like, how was your experience? Let us know. Take the survey. So I took the survey and basically stated the same thing. Service was great. We'd definitely come back again. But the food came out slow. Well, because of that, I guess on top of the fact they remembered me complaining at the restaurant, and then I complained in the survey about the slow food, food being slow, he emailed me back and said, hey, come in, have dinner on us. Like, All right. So we're having free dinner tonight at El Centro. I've never actually had dinner there before, so I'm kind of excited. But it's not looking like too terribly busy of a week to start. As far as work goes, we'll see how that lasts. But I am now at the Metro. I'll talk with you later. Happy Good Tuesday morning, everyone. Welcome to my daily vlog. <clears throat> so... Um, not much going on. It's cloudy. It's Tuesday. My beard looks a mess. God, does my beard look a mess. Um, yeah. Not much to really talk about. <clears throat> Yesterday was a fairly productive day. Oh! Um, <clears throat> update went to El Centro yesterday. A little backstory. Um, two Sundays ago, uh, service was, eh, subpar for that place. It was still okay, but the, man the manager noticed that I was not happy and offered us, uh, to come back on Monday for free dinner. Dinner was incredible. Not only was it, like, incredible, incredible, but, like, I was thinking, okay, we'll get, like, an entree for free and, like, maybe, like, a soda or something, you know? No, not only did they give us free guacamole, free entrees, free desserts, they also gave us free two, uh, two free margaritas. Like, whoa, that's how you take care of a customer. It sucks because I wasn't anticipating that. And there's no way I was going to walk away and not tip the server, but I felt like I under tipped her. Because if you add that up, that's probably a hundred dollar bill. For everything at least and unfortunately I just did not have enough cash to tip her how I felt should have been tipped how she should have been tipped appropriately we ended up tipping her $16 which is about what you tip for an $80 bill so uh, that sucks I feel really bad but next time we go there if she's working I'm definitely gonna give her a nice tip she was incredible. Her name was Elise. Definitely asked for Elise if possible. We go to El Centro. Um, I 
let's see what else yeah i mean other than that it was a good night unfortunately right now i guess because of the season there's not a lot on tv so I don't have a lot of tv to really talk about american dad was on last night okay um, the only thing sitting in my DVR is The Real Housewives of Atlanta. Also, on top of that, mentioning TV, um, I'm in the process of trying to see if it's possible to get rid of cable TV. So what I've been doing is I've been trying out different video services, trying out Netflix right now, I'm trying out Slim TV. Um, next, I'm probably going to try out uh, DirecTV Now and Hulu. Probably what I'll try next. I'm just trying to see if I can solely live off the internet with video streaming services. I think it's going to be tough, especially the lack of DVR, but there's ways around that. Yeah, it's just be a tough change, but I've got to get this cable bill lowered. I've got to get these bills lowered, period. All right, guys, I'm at the Metro. I'll talk with you later. Good evening, everybody. So, number one, it's cold. It got really cold really fast. And it's supposed to be even colder tomorrow and colder Thursday and colder Friday. So, yeah. Wow. Winter's trying to get here in a hurry. So, work was actually kind of slow today. I did a lot of, Chris, uh, I guess, window shopping online. I don't know how you'd put that. Browser shopping. Actually, not really window shopping. Some potential Christmas shopping. Let's put it that way. I went on Amazon, found some stuff I want to buy for Christmas gifts, and put it on my wish list. How about that? <laughs> yeah, it was a little slow today. Um... So, um, I don't know. I do want to say, though, that for whatever reason today, my Philly, my Philly group has been on my mind. I just got to say, I miss you, Masso. I miss you, Greg. I miss you, LT Pupper. I miss you, Cal. Miss you guys. Really think been thinking about you today. Just thought I'd put that out there. So plan for tonight is to catch up on the DVR a little bit. What am I well I can't really. I don't know. I'm still learning Sling TV. I've got Sling TV until the 19th, and then my next step is gonna be to try direct TV now, as you guys probably know by now. Um I not, I want, like out of everything that I've tried so far, actually PlayStation View is my favorite. The only reason I'm not doing it is because they got rid of all the Viacom channels. I gotta have my Viacom channels, I do. So that's not a good thing. It's the only thing that's keeping me from even considering PlayStation View right now. Um. Yeah, uh, so the plan for tonight, catch up on the DVR or and or play with other options to see how I can watch the stuff that's in my DVR because if I get rid of cable, then I won't have a DVR. So there's that. Um, let me think. Obviously, heat up some food. I'm probably going to do laundry. Um, need to shave my head. Yeah. A few things planned for tonight. Not much going on. But Christmas time is closer and closer and closer. Oh my goodness. I actually have one of the Christmas gifts in my hand right now. Um, yeah. Uh, holidays are always a little rough for me. Um, I was very fortunate to have Christian for thank around for Thanksgiving because he invited me out and I got to spend Thanksgiving with him and with some of his friends and it was a good time and 
I'm going to be very fortunate this year to be able to spend Christmas with Will. So yeah, good times. Good times are ahead. And then New Year's is going to be fun. Oh my God, I can't believe I'm already talking about New Year's. Well, seems like November and December just fly by. Um, yeah, not much really all to talk about right now. Can't think of anything, but I will talk to you guys later. Laundry room going up on a Tuesday.